The tests are performed for uplink communication about frequency hopping and frame repetition. Firstly, before shipping the device to Sigfox, 10 consecutive messages must be emitted by the device and received by the Sigfox cloud. Frequency hopping and spreading is checked. Three repetition of each message must be received by the Sigfox cloud. Secondly, the proper radiation performance is evaluated. The device is set in continuous wave mode and the effective radiated power is measured. This test is performed in an anechoic chamber of a certification lab selected by Sigfox. Based on the ERP, a radiation pattern can be elaborated either in two dimensions or three dimensions, and, if available, through a SMA connector or any other easy connection, the conducted power can also be measured. The device is placed on a turntable, so the ERP is measured for every angle. As an example, this is the radiation pattern of the key app, the first Sigfox network tester. This is the reference device used by Sigfox to assess the network. The radiation pattern shows the vertical polarization. The device is clearly omnidirectional. The radiated pattern also shows the very low ERP power in horizontal polarization. As the Sigfox network is based on a star topology, it's highly important that the device radiates in an omnidirectional way. This other example is the radiation pattern of the Sensit. This device is also made by Sigfox. In three dimensions, it's even more clear that this device is omnidirectional as ERP is distributed regularly in the X, Y, and Z axis.